My name is Deborah Hazelton. I live here at Thaxter Park. Millie is one of my neighbors. And um, Madge Karen had originally told me she wanted to plan a 100th birthday party for Millie. And she asked me if I would help her, and I said, of course. So uh, Madge went out and bought a um, notebook for Millie to write down some notes of her life. Millie wrote her story and gave it back to Madge. So I read the story and said, okay, I'll type it up for you. But one thing led to another, and besides the book that Madge had, Millie kept giving Madge extra pages to her life story. And she's lived a lot. She's been through prohibition. She's gone through um, the jazz, the Roaring Twenties and the jazz era, the big band era. She's gone through the women's vote. She's, she's seen a lot of history and she's participated in a lot of history. She was um, a ground patroller during World War II. And she did the inlets and the marshes and the rocky shores, as she puts it, um, along Hingham, Cohasset, and Situate. And occasionally she would go into Boston and guard the um, Hancock building. She's been through a lot. Millie's been through a lot. She's faced a lot of personal tragedy in her day. And because of my own situation, I've asked Millie, how in the world did you survive it? How did you get through it in one piece? And she said, you just have to do it. You just have to put one foot in front of the other and keep going. In Millie's diary, we, we um, surmised that, as you can tell in Millie's words, I have experienced many, many things. The horse and buggy days, the trolleys, the modernization of the motor vehicle. I've known the Iceman, the Ragman, and the Milkman. I've lived through Prohibition, the Roaring Twenties and Jazz Age, the Women's Right to Vote, 12 Presidents. I've experienced the first television broadcast, in 1928, the Hindenburg in 1937, the Big Bang era, the Coconut Grove Fire in Boston in 1942. I went through the Great Depression and the stock market crash, and somehow I survived it all. Millie has often said, I've lived a full life, and I'm still living it. She said, and I'm having a good time. And she said, I think that makes a big difference in life.